<laughs> Hi guys. Hello. Guess what? What? Chicken butt. But also, we're going to teach you about portion control. Okay, so how Kyle and I lost 260 pounds um, or 130 pounds each was through portion control. And a lot of people say, okay, I want to do portion control like you, but I don't know how to do it. So this video is about how you do portion control for weight loss. Losing weight, it's not just a physical thing. It's here and it's here. Fight through it. You can do it. Don't give up. What you need to get started, measuring spoons and cups, a food scale, and some meal prep containers. These are all found friends. You can find them at the dollar store, grocery stores. Walmart. Walmart. Our food scale is a perfect portions from Bed Bath & Beyond. Yes, but you can find scale food scales anywhere. Any food scale and any measuring cups, spoons will do. The other thing that you need, foods that you want to eat. So let's start with the most basic, which are foods that are coming in packages that have labels on them. How you do a portion for food with a label is you check the label and you look at the serving size on the top. So for this Harvest Crunch, a serving is two thirds of a cup. So for Harvest Crunch, if you want to eat it, you would get your measuring cup and you would measure out two thirds of a cup of that. All That's one portion. All packaged foods will tell you the portion size on the side, bottom, front of the box. Wherever. Exactly, so that's what that looks like. One serving of these whole grain crackers is four crackers. So there is a serving of crackers there. This one, one serving of this stew is one cup which when you start looking at serving sizes, they're actually pretty decent, decent portions. So you would eat the one serving for your meal. When you start getting into things like fruits and veggies that don't have a label, for us, Kyle and I use one serving as a half a cup of fruit and veggies. So frozen fruit, berries, sliced or diced fruit, any type of veggie, half a cup is one serving. That is half a cup or one serving of baby carrots. When you get into pieces of fruit, anything small we consider one serving. So a small banana, a small apple, you know, a small pear, those are all one serving. For things like this cheese that is measured in grams or ounces, one serving of cheese is 30 grams. You would use a food scale for that. So you would turn your scale on and measure out um, your cheese until you get 30 grams and 30 grams of cheese looks like that um, That is 30 grams for something like salad um, or Veggie I'm um, sorry like lettuce or spinach We consider one serving of that as one cup because it's more Voluminous so if you measured half a cup, it wouldn't give you a very much so we do one serving as a cup but we like to eat two servings of salad when we eat salad, so that would be two cups. Remember, this, all this information is what we did to lose weight. Yes, these are the portions that we used based off of the labels and serving sizes. We figured out the serving sizes for us. So two cups for salads, um, half a cup for fruits and veggies, three, uh, sorry, three ounces or 30 grams of cheese, and then for meat, it's the same thing you use your food scale. So this one is mine. It is three ounces of lean ground beef. So I just took my container, put it on my food scale, and measured out my serving size. We like to do three to four ounces of lean protein. Um, so that's also something that you can do with your meats. That's what we started out with. So it's basically, trial and error. So what you do is you start with a portion of each thing or you know two servings of salad and then you go from there. If you are not losing weight then you might want to pull back your servings a little. If you're losing weight, stay. Um, so it's trial and error and all portion control. This is exactly what we did to lose our first 50-60 pounds. And we still use the measuring cups as you can see they're really worn we still use measuring cups we always will and we always will so friends we hope that this video gave you a little 
inspiration and motivation and gave you some ideas on how to use portion control for weight loss. So, don't forget to like and subscribe. <laughs> or what? Old worn out measuring cup of doom. Thanks for watching. Bye, friends. Bye, guys. Our complete weight loss guide is finally here. We put our heart and souls into it, friends. It has 40 family friendly recipes. Not only is there a two week full meal plan for you, there is a blueprint on how to make your own. The toning moves to prevent loose skin, to tighten up the loose skin, it's all in there. Everything you will ever need to know, you ever wanted to know about how we lost weight, it is there. 